receive the body of Christ in desire so let's thank the Lord these days I'm going to give you some word of God which you will be you can repeat every day whenever it's possible it is going to be a powerful strength for you and your whole family in these moments of crisis let us repeat this word of God um, once or twice or maybe three times a day uh, let's repeat Zechariah chapter 10, 10 verse uh, 6. Zechariah chapter 10 verse 6. Let us repeat after me. I will strengthen the house of Judah and I will save the house of Joseph. I will bring them back because I have compassion on them. And they shall be as though I am not rejected them. And they shall be as though I have not rejected them. For I am the Lord their God. For I am the Lord their God. And I will answer them. And I will answer them. I will strengthen the house of Jake Judah. I will strengthen the house of Judah. And I will save the house of Joseph. And I will save the house of Joseph. I will bring them back. I will bring them back. Because I have compassion on them. Because I have compassion on them. And they shall be as though. And they shall be as though. I had not rejected them. I had not rejected them. For I am the Lord their God. For I am the Lord their God. And I will answer them. And I will answer them. Let's repeat it with confidence and with convic conviction that the Lord is there to help us. Repeat loudly, I will strengthen the house of Judah. I will strengthen the house of Judah. And I will save the house of Joseph. And I will save the house of Joseph. I will bring them back. I will bring them back. Because I have compassion on them. Because I have compassion on them. And they shall be as though. And they shall be as though. I had not rejected them. I had not rejected them. For I am the Lord their God. For I am the Lord their God. And I will answer them. And I will answer them. Let us Jeremiah chapter 32. Jeremiah 32, verse 39 onwards. Jeremiah 32. Them. After them. I will make an everlasting covenant. I will make an everlasting covenant with them. Never to draw back. Never to draw back. From doing good to them. From doing good to them. And I will put the fear of me. And I will put the fear of me. So let's repeat this word of God. And Ezekiel, next week, verse 26. We read like this. A new heart I will give you. A new heart I will give you. And a new spirit I will put within you. And a new spirit I will put within you. And I will remove from your body. And I will remove from your body. The heart of stone. And give you. A heart of flesh. A heart of flesh. I will put my spirit. I will put my spirit. Within you. Within you. And make you. And make you. Follow my statues. Follow my statues. And be careful. And be careful. To observe. To observe my ordinance, I will answer them. I will answer them. I will be with them in trouble. I will be with them in trouble. I will rescue them. I will rescue them. And honor them. And honor them. Let's repeat once again. Six. We read like this. And the one who was seated. And the one who was seated. On the throne said. On the throne said. See. See. I am making all things new. I am making all things new. Also he said. Also he said. Write this. Write this. Write this. Write this. For these words are. For these words are. Trustworthy. Trustworthy. And true. And true. These words are. These words are. Trustworthy and true. Trustworthy and true. Then he said to me. Then he said to me. It is done. It is done. I am the Alpha. I am the Alpha. And the Omega. And the Omega. As a gift, as a gift from the spring of the water of from, life. From the spring of the water of life. Let's read 66. 
66 verse 13. Let's re read from our heart. As a mother comfort her child. As a mother comforts her child. So I'll comfort you. So I will comfort you. You shall be comforted in Jerusalem. You shall be comforted. Say mother comforts her child. As a mother comforts her child. So I will comfort you. So I will comfort you. You shall be comforted in Jerusalem. You shall be comforted in Jerusalem. Everybody together. As a mother comforts her child. As a mother comforts her child. So I will comfort you. So I will comfort. You. you shall be comforted. You shall be comforted in Jerusalem. In Iran. In Iran. In South Korea, a child. As mother comforts a child. So I will comfort you. So I will comfort you. You shall be come. Ten fourteen. We read Psalm ten fourteen. Book of Psalm ten was fourteen. The word of God says like this: You may take it into your hands. The helpless commit themselves. The helpless commit themselves to you. You have been, you have been the helper, the helper of the orphan, of the orphan. The former things, the former things, or consider, or consider the things of all. At least ten. Let us pray. Heavenly banquet at which we have been fed. Sanctify us, O Lord, and cleansing us of all errors of your promises from on high through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and may harm them. Keep and stay in the anointed hands. Let them be eager to be with you, to proclaim your good news and fight to, to fight against the evil one. Lord, give your church holy priests religious and lay. Be yes, our safeguard against, against the wickedness and snares yes, of the devil. May, may God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And, and do thou oppress the heavenly host by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who crawl through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safe crawl through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, the power of God cast into heaven. Do not despise our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin, Amen. We fly to thy protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. We fly to thy protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. Psalm 91. You who live in the shelter of the Most High, who abide in the shadow of the Almighty, will say to the Lord, my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust, for he will deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence he will cover you with his pinions and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness is a shield and buckler. You will not fear the terror of the night or the arrow that flies by day or the pestilence that stalks in darkness or the destruction that they fall at your side 10,000 at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only look with your eyes and see the punishment. All your ways on the with long life, I will satisfy them and show them my salvation. Thank you. 
Jesus. 